there's, there's two um, aspects to it. There's two aspects to it. One aspect is seeing, is seeing the correct seeing of how other people, what you call uh, negative people. Because for me, when I look around, I, don't, I actually don't see negative people. <laughs> there's no such thing as a negative person in my being, you know? I just see, I just see like, everybody is just like, exactly the same as me. <laughs> Happy, but they don't know it. They don't know it. <laughs> they, they forgot it. <laughs> so all I have to do is just friendly, you know, friendly reminder of that they are actually already happy. That you are actually already happy. You just gotta let go of the other wrong, false thoughts. <laughs> That's all of who you are. You're already happy. You know. See. So, so it's a it one. It's a, it's a certain way you see people. You know, because. <laughs> When you see negative people, right, what you call negative people, the more that you see how negative someone is, the more the, the impact, the impact that has on you. For example, let me show you a silly metaphor that comes to me right now, but it kind of makes sense. It helps to uh, depict this. Let's say a person gets... Uh, is, uh, let, let's say a person uh, is going to be uh, bitten by a dog in the destiny. In, in the destiny. <laughs> Look, you know, it's not a, a good thing. <laughs> no one wants that. Let's say on the, uh, let's say on the calf muscle. <laughs> you know, like that, and you can't avoid it. But, but imagine that <laughs> the person, whatever they see, uh, whatever they see, in other words, what size of the dog they see, <laughs> you know, becomes the reality. <laughs> so if they see, oh my God, that's a big dog that's going to bite me, and the des like, because in the destiny it will bite, <laughs> so it's going to be a big dog that's going to bite their calf, they're not going to have much calf muscle left. <laughs> you know? But if they see, if they see uh, that that dog is only a tiny chihuahua. <laughs> you know, like, you know, it has, still has a bit of a bite. And, you know, you're gonna cop it. <laughs> you're gonna cop it, ouch! But you're not gonna lose your whole calf muscle. You know, <laughs> like that. So that's a, that's a metaphor that I want you to see, uh, that when you see negative people, the way you see people has impact on you, you has impact on you, you know? If you're seeing that the very negative, oh, there's a so negative person in front of me I'm living with, I'm working with. So that means each time they kind of root to you, it feels like a big dog biting you. <laughs> Not a little chihuahua gun, like that. <laughs> you understand now? So that's one way you gotta look at it, you know? Uh, you gotta have the right mindset. <laughs> Ideally, when you see negative people, you think negative, you don't see like that. You just see, oh my God. That person's a saint. So kind and loving. Uh, you know, they just they have just forgotten. You know, they have just fallen over recently and have uh, ab amnesia. <laughs> They've forgotten. But once you know, like once they um, remember again, once they recover from the amnesia, oh, they're gonna be a full on kindness, amazing saint. You just see, you don't see the negative person. You see a saint. <laughs> See you're saying. You don't, you, don't, you don't see these eyes because they're going, oh, you idiot, you know, whatever, whatever, like that. You know? And you stuffed up. <laughs> or whatever. You, know? you see the person as a saint. You don't see them as negative. That's the first uh, side to look at it. Um, you know? Now, the second side is... Uh, you got. You have to see if that dog's gonna bite you. If that dog's gonna bite you, right? Uh, you wanna make sure. You wanna make sure that you are strong. You are strong because if you if you're weak and your immune system is weak, then uh, with that dog bites you, if it has some disease or something, you're gonna get it, and you know you're gonna you're gonna experience it in a bad way. But if you are strong, if you are strong 
and healthy. <laughs> you've been exercising, you've been doing soul healing, you've been meditating, you've been praying to God for blessings, <laughs> you know, and you've been kind to humanity, so therefore they, they, people love you and they're nice to you because you're kind to them and they therefore that they give you their blessing as well. <laughs> and oh my God, and, and your, your immune system is strong, the source is flying to you. And so that, when the dog bites you, ouch, my God, I didn't need it that. <laughs> but then, look at it. Most of the calf muscle is still there. <laughs> you know? And uh, it's drawing a bit, bit of blood. <laughs> you know, you, you check it out, get a doctor, bandage up, whatever you do. <laughs> but you just know that's going to heal up. No problem at all. Like that. <laughs> you know? No problem at all. <laughs> you know? So... Uh, that's that's how you deal with it. You basically strengthen yourself. You strengthen yourself, you know. So uh, you're not like hiding away from people. Any negative people, you run away. Any any, any negative people, you run away. <laughs> We're gonna run away too. <laughs> the whole planet is, generally speaking, at the moment negative. <laughs> this is what you call the 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 color yuga in in Sanskrit in India. They call this uh, this the color yuga. The the basically the the dark age. You know, we're going to move to the golden age very soon. We're just about to move to the golden age, but right now we're still the tail end of the dark age. So, but that means that almost everyone's pretty much negative. So, where are you going to move to? Unless you kind of just isolate yourself and don't see anybody, hide away from people. But after those three months, you're going to miss people. <laughs> like, what are you going to do there? You're going to be looking for people. You're like, oh, I'm a bit lonely. I, I want, you know, I want a boyfriend or a girlfriend. You know. No, <laughs> you're gonna be looking. You're gonna miss people. You know, <laughs> like this. See? What are you gonna? Do? What are you gonna do? Yeah. So much better. You know, don't hide away from people. Just strengthen yourself. <laughs> strengthen yourself. You know? by opening up your heart. You know, letting go the negative energy out of you. All that fear. All the rules you have. Just let it go. Let it go. Meditate daily as much as you can. When I was meditating, uh, you know, on my spirit journey, when I was meditating, <laughs> I was meditating from the moment my eyes open in the morning all the way until my eyes are closed. Like, I always have that mindset every moment, you know, every moment like that. Like, meditate. Like, you don't have to meditate like, like that much unless you want to attain enlightenment, you know, I, I don't know, you, you might want to do that, you know, but I dare you, <laughs> I dare you, <laughs> you know, I love that, I'm just being silly, don't worry about me, I'm being silly, <laughs> you know, but, you know, meditate, meditate, you know, you know? open your heart, you know, like read spiritual books, Read spiritual books, books that, books that, beautiful spiritual books, books that move your, your heart, opens your heart. Read autobiography of great saints, you know, great masters and great saints, you know, because whatever you see, whatever goes in you, whatever you see, you becomes reality, you know, uh, as I talked before, I shared before. Uh, today so when you read these uh, great masters lives somehow that life just goes into you the actual how they are you know the saintliness in them the great master in them goes in you you know but make sure uh, when you read uh, these books read with your open heart otherwise you'll be just getting more knowledge just in intellectual knowledge and you just clog up the system and then you need to clean out uh, what you call a healing, and then you know it costs you money. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like that. You know? No. Basically, um, uh, uh, basically, uh, don't see, don't see them as negative people. With negative. See them as saints already saying that I know it and just work at yourself just work at yourself strengthen yourself strengthen yourself 
so that when the bite comes, you're like, oh, that's nothing. That just tickled. When people root to you, it's tickled. Financial difficulty, no problem. <laughs> you know, sickness, oh, that's nothing. My body just heal up. And it does. Because your attitude like that, you see? Bang, it heals up like that.